the age of eight, Bridget Mendler started to act in local plays, both musicals. We are not down. She eventually became the youngest performer oh, yeah, we got that in the dream. San Francisco Fringe Festival. In 2004, at the age of 12, she got her Hold first. Hold on. <laughs> Dang, okay, dreamer. Movie role voicing a character in an Indian movie called The Legend of Buddha. Over the next five years, she got to act in a couple of movies and shows. And during this period, Bridget was constantly auditioning for Disney Channel shows like Sunny with a Chance in 2007. But in 2009, she finally landed a recurring role on Wizards of Waverly. Time Place, to come on that video, yeah. opened you. up a chance for her to star in her own show, Good Luck Charlie. It premiered on April 4th, 2010 to 4.7 million viewers. That's the highest mark for Disney Channel in four years. Hey, that's pretty good. True. From this point on, Bridget was a household name for any kid that's a ages fact. Of 7 to 13. Over the next four years, she if Good Luck Charlie Charlie isn't in anyone's Disney's top 10, here the they, like when it comes to shows, they need help. Like I'm not going listening on to, to you. Be a lead singer in the fictional band, which produced top 100 singles like Determinate and Somebody. After the success of Lemonade Mouth, Disney thought it only right to try musical career for Bridget. Simmons you never watched it, Drax. She appeared. Never mind. They don't uh, have it twice with absolute bangers, Ready or Not and Hurricane. Ready or not, here I come. Oh. Ready or Not eventually went <laughs> platinum and Hurricane eventually went gold. After 97 episodes of Good Luck Charlie, it officially ended in 2014. Bridget went on tour the same Ironic. year and eventually released an EP in 2016, which led to another tour the same year. For the next three years, she was a part of two seasons of Undateable and starred in one season of Merry, Happy, Whatever, and was in one movie titled Father of the Year. And that's it. Since 2019, Bridget hasn't released any new music or acted in any new project. And her social media presence has dwindled over the years. Her last tweets were teasing new music in 2022. So as of now, Bridget is a Disney star, platinum selling artist, and doctor. Hold up. Wait a minute. Doctor? Still ain't right. Let's rewind real quick. Let me tell the full story. In 2013, after her album's release, Bridget enrolled at USC and earned an anthropology degree in 2016. The following year, she was named as one of the new director fellows for MIT's Media Lab. And in 2018, she officially announced she started a graduate program at MIT. In 2020, she completed her master's degree, but not before enrolling at Harvard Law School in 2019. Also yeah. in 2019, <laughs> she did get married. I keep on accidentally clicking stuff. <laughs> As of now, she is both a second-year student at Harvard and pursuing a doctorate from MIT's Center of Constructive Communications so, so, and Social Machines group. She so you're saying if I go to Harvard, I, I can have a chance. For years, I struggled with social media because I felt like there was a more... Screw good luck, Charlie. It's good luck, Bolt. <laughs> Through her studies, she's joke. able to learn about public input and government decision-making, how voices can be <laughs> translated through social media and any form of technology. She describes herself as a very random person. She has been tempted to come back to entertainment Harvard would never take you, buddy. And scripts, but as of now, she is focused on building upon her research. But you yeah, hate me. that's it. The full story of how you know I'm Mender, smart. Don't hate me. Disney star and platinum selling artist became a doctor. Pending. But I think we all know she'll get it done. This is so fine. I get jealous when I see this. I am not doing an IQ test on the stream today. <laughs> you're the, you're the, you're the, the video as per usual. Thank you.